Hey everybody, I wanted to make a quick video today on a subject that I've been thinking about for uh, the past couple of days here. And uh, it's something that I hear a lot, I think many of us hear a lot uh, from our peers, and that is, well, I'm not religious, but I'm spiritual. And I don't go to church, but I meditate. Now, I, I want to dive a little bit deeper into meditation. And in many forms of meditation, we are often trying to empty out everything of ourselves. We're trying to make ourselves empty or we're trying to focus very clearly on our mission or our own goal. And I think what we have to keep in mind here is that there's many forms of meditation that while we're doing this is actually not very good for our soul. And the reason being is because in reality, we should be focusing on how we can fill our mind and our spirit with the Holy Spirit and with God's will. We should look at having God's will before our own will. And there is all forms of Christian meditation that we can focus on that is holy and that is good for our souls. But when we begin going into other avenues to find happiness and moving away from the Lord moving away from what Christ has taught us and what the church has taught us, we begin to go into avenues that could potentially be dangerous to our souls and opening us up into things that we do not want to come into our spirits. It's something to keep in mind. I think that not all meditation is bad, but meditation where we are not focusing on the will of God, we're putting everything out of our body, we're emptying ourselves out. That is not what we should be doing. That is not what we should be doing at all. We should be filling ourselves up with the will of Christ and the will of God and the Holy Spirit. It's something to keep in mind. Take a look at your own life, how you're, uh, how you're inviting prayer into your own life. And if you, if you are practicing meditation, and think about how uh, you can focus back on, on Jesus, on bringing the will of God. And I think a, a great place to do that is meditating upon the mysteries of the rosary. Uh, praying the Holy Rosary. I think it's the best form of meditation that you can possibly do, and I would invite you to start there. God bless and carry your cross.